everyone i hope you're all doing well welcome back to my channel and welcome to another what i wore in a week video this is the first what i wore in a week in a while that doesn't just include loungewear and outfits to wear at home i've got a few more going out outfits and more outfits appropriate for the pub um restaurants bars uh shopping all that sort of stuff so um, yeah, I really hope you enjoy it. I've got quite a few new pieces that I haven't shown yet on my channel. But yeah, the first part of the video is in collaboration with GOTD Glasses of the Day. Hence why I'm sat down here because it's just easier to talk rather than in the mirror. Um, but I have these beautiful new sunglasses to show you. Um, you guys know, well you will know if you've watched my other videos that I am... Um, just obsessed with sunglasses at the moment the weather's not great but i'm still buying sunglasses i'm still wearing sunglasses i just love them and i have this amazing pair from um, gotd glasses of the day which are a uk based um, glasses brand and they primarily specialize in prescription glasses and prescription sunglasses but you can just get normal glasses and normal sunglasses um like i have here but first of all let me just show you this gorgeous box, which I'm definitely going to keep for them. Lovely navy and gold combination, which is one of my favourites. And it just slides open. And got a little care card in there, so everything you need to know. And then, my favourite part, this beautiful case for the glasses. Now, not only is it like a lovely tan leather, but it has my initials on it. Can you see there? A, B which I love, I love things with my initials on it, so you can get the cases personalised. And I love this tan leather, I never used to, um, but I think this tan leather is perfect for summertime, and yeah, I just love it at the moment. And then these are the sunglasses that I have to show you, these are the Millicent ones, and they are this gorgeous, like, almost tinted rose colour um, in the frames, and then they have a little white bit at the side, which I love, because I wear a lot of white. So this is what they look like on absolutely beautiful stunning simple round shape which is one of my favorite shapes to wear actually and i think it suits my face quite well um but yeah absolutely love these i'm going to be wearing them today when i go out even though it's not that sunny so as i mentioned this is actually a uk based brand run by opticians and they offer free glasses advice and stuff like that so super helpful if you've got any questions they're going to be very knowledgeable and you're in the best hands basically if you are looking for a specific prescription in your sunglasses which i think is super handy if you do need it but i absolutely love these i think they're gorgeous so elegant i love the white detail as you can see on the back there when it focuses in your own time just got the little gotd logo on the side these are extremely well made amazing quality the fit is perfect for me so comfortable really easy to wear i could tell these would be really comfortable to wear all day and they go with pretty much everything that i own they're a really simple style but the the color of the lens is slightly different to anything else i've got so it's a really nice touch i also think this color is really nice and summery as well and the white goes lovely with the vest that i have on today so yeah i'm super happy with these so as i said they primarily offer prescription glasses so if you do have a prescription and you're after a really good quality pair of glasses or sunglasses definitely check them out if you want to have a look at the website i will leave all that information in the description box along with the instagram and anything else you might need to know and i will link this specific pair the millicent ones that i have been wearing because these are amazing i think quite a lot of you will like these i also have a discount code which is amy15 and that will get you yes you guessed it 15 percent off all orders so anything you want to order you can get 15% off. I'll put my code on the screen now and I will also pop it in the description box for you um, in case you wanna have a little browse and a little shop because now is the perfect time to purchase some sunglasses because I've got a feeling July is gonna be a sunny month. I might be wrong, but I've just got that feeling. Um, I'm gonna keep these on because they go so nicely with my outfit um, and I'm gonna show you the rest of my outfit in the mirror now. So it's not massively warm today. It's supposed to brighten up a little bit later, but um, I really wanted to show you guys this new dress. It's from Zara. I mentioned it in my new in haul, which has gone up by now, so you will have seen that. Um, but it's just this gorgeous like ribbed halter neck midi dress. So comfy. Um, really flattering. Uh, they do it in three other colours as well. A black, a 
like green and a pink I think or like a beige colour um, but yeah I absolutely love this the best part about it is it was only 9 99 super handy you can dress this down so easily with some trainers and a denim jacket or you can dress it up a little bit like I have um, with some loafers and a blazer or you could even put heels with it and a clutch and wear it on a night out but I absolutely love it I really hope it's still in stock for you guys when this video goes up because it actually took me ages to get hold of it I kept um, having to put in my email in um, and say notify me when it comes back in stock in a size small and every time I got the email I'd literally go straight onto the Zara website and it'd already be gone so there were some people out there with very fast fingers getting the dress before I did. Um, but I got it eventually anyway, basically, is what I'm trying to say. And I got a size small, it fits perfectly. I'm hoping to get my hands on the black one, but that's been out of stock for ages. So hopefully this white one is in stock for you, or maybe you might like the beige or the green. But yeah, I could not show you this. Um, this would also be quite a nice maybe like work outfit if you work in a more casual office, because it's quite smart with the blazer and the loafers. Um, but also really comfy and a little bit chic as well. Um, but the other bits of the outfit, I have this lovely gold chain necklace on from ASOS, which I'm obsessed with at the moment, really nice and simple. Um, I also have my favorite blazer, my Zara oversized black blazer. I'll probably roll the sleeves up actually with this outfit because I think that would look better. This blazer I get asked about all the time and it's old, I'm sorry. It's not available on Zara anymore, but there's a very, very similar one from And Other Stories which is a little bit more expensive, but I just think you have to invest in a classic, good fitting, good quality black blazer um, because you're gonna need one. You always need a black blazer. They're a wardrobe staple. So I will link the and other stories one and I will link a cheaper alternative as well if you wanna spend a bit less on a blazer. And to finish off the look, I am wearing my slip on loafers. These I just picked up from eBay. They're really comfy and I'm not wearing them enough actually, but I think that's because I haven't really been out. So I'm sure I will wear them when I'm finally going out again. But I just think they finish off this look nicely and I'll probably pick up a little black bag as well to take with me. This is my Monday outfit, very smart for Monday. And don't forget you can get 15% off with Amy15 at GOTD. Happy Tuesday everyone. I am just about to take the dog out. So I thought I would show you my very relaxed outfit for today. So I have got on this big oversized Nike jumper. Um, this is really old, I think it's vintage. I don't actually remember where I got it, but it's just a big oversized white jumper and it hangs quite loose, um, which is quite nice. It's different to anything that I have. Obviously I have on my Nike cap um, because it matches quite well. It's not very nice weather, it's a bit chilly today. So I have got my grey joggers on as well from Pretty Little Thing. These are like a really light mild grey, but if you have followed me on Instagram or heard me talk about these joggers before, you will know that they are my ultimate favourite. I wear these in a size medium and they're just some of the best fitting joggers that I've ever owned. Um, and I also have on just some Nike socks and my new Axle Regato trainers, which again, like the last what I wore in a week, you can expect to see a lot of, um, because I've literally been wearing them pretty much every single day. This was sort of like an outfit that I planned in my head just quickly to go on a dog walk in, and I feel like I look a bit weird, but <laughs> it's very white and bright, but I'm only going to walk the dog and, um, yeah, it'll do. Happy Wednesday. I am very casual again. No surprise there. Just have my oversized grey jumper on from PLT, which I literally live in. I wear this in a size... What size is it? Size large. No surprise. Um, yeah, I wear this in a size large and, like I said, I live in it. I wear it so much. It's so comfy. Um, I love grey at the moment as well, so yeah, I'm always in this. Um, I've got some new jewellery on today, actually. I've got this necklace on from um, Ashley Clark, and then these earrings, I think I've shown both of them before, but all my jewellery is linked in the top of the description box separately to the outfit, so if you're looking for a particular piece of jewellery that I'm wearing, that's where it will be. With my oversized jumper, I've just got on some grey cycling shorts. Again, these are from Pretty Little Thing. They're a pretty close match, actually, to the jumper. 
almost identical but I have just had a bath that's why I'm fresh faced and I've got my hair up um, and I've just moisturized my legs so that's why I've got shorts on it's definitely not shorts weather today and then on my feet once again I have Nike socks and my Axler Regato trainers prepare to see a lot of this combination on my channel um, it's my favorite thing to wear at the moment so that's it for my Wednesday outfit I'm probably not going to do anything today apart from take the dog out later when the weather is a bit cooler like it is today i just swap out the cycling shorts for joggers so i'll probably do that later and then you can equally just swap out the jumper for a t-shirt or a vest or anything like that so really versatile items and easy to pair with lots of things in my wardrobe hello and welcome to another day full of miserable weather i am wearing jeans and a jumper in july which is pretty sad but it's miserable today, it's quite chilly, um, so I just fancied something a little bit warmer. I am wearing this cropped um, light grey jumper from Pretty Little Thing. It's basically just like a cut off version of what I had on yesterday, um, but it's slightly lighter. I've had this for literally years. Um, I bought this when I was at uni, so it's at least maybe like two or three years old, but I love it. It's so handy to have and goes with everything. I actually have the exact joggers to match it um, and then I also have on these jeans these are the Topshop mum jeans um, in this slightly darker wash than I normally wear um, I don't wear these ones as much as my premium mum jeans um, just because they're not as comfy but I do still like these a nice slightly darker blue wash these are also um, a longer leg I think I got these in a leg 34 um, I can't remember but I like the way they sort of like bunch up at the bottom because they look like more of a straight leg jean and then I have my triple S trainers on as well because I just thought that I'd worn my Axel Regato ones a bit too much this week already so I thought I'll put my triple S on because I still love them um, and I still wear them loads. So that's it basically, a very simple outfit, jeans and a jumper, perfect for a more chilly day today. The jumper I'm wearing in a size small um, and it's a little bit oversized, a little bit loose fitting, the arms are quite long and my jeans I'm wearing in a waist 28 uh, leg 34. I normally take a waist 28 or sometimes waist 26, it depends on the style of jean um, and a leg 32 in Topshop jeans and they're my favourite jeans really, they fit so nicely. So yeah, I will catch up with you tomorrow when I've got a different outfit on. Hi everyone, we made it to Friday. Today is Friday the 3rd, I had lipstick on my teeth but I don't think I do. Today is Friday the 3rd of July and tomorrow is Saturday the 4th, um, otherwise known as Super Saturday all the bars, restaurants, pubs are reopening again and I'm sure a lot of you will be heading out for your first drink or meal or whatever this weekend so um, I thought I'd give you a little bit of inspo for that. I'm myself not going out but I'll get into that in a different video. I thought you guys would be, at least some of you maybe anyway, so I thought it's about time I started showing you some more dressy outfits that you can wear out um, for date nights, for dinner with the girls, for whatever you have planned for the next few weeks. So I basically looked in my wardrobe and thought if I was going out tomorrow um, for a nice meal or for a drink, what would I wear? And I picked up these pieces, all pieces that I've owned for quite a while, a nice simple, staple, comfortable outfit. Have on this black tee from Mango, it's a muscle tee. I love it. Um, I have three of these now in all different colours and they're just so handy. A little bit different to your average t-shirt, um, obviously because of the structured shoulder and they just make things a little bit more dressy um, as opposed to like a normal black t-shirt or vest. This is just a little bit different. I then have on my new chain from ASOS. Um, this is just a plain gold linked chain, very simple. And I have on my blue Topshop premium mum jeans. I absolutely love these, so comfy. They're the perfect thing for dinner or for drinks because they're really easy to sit down in. Um, I don't have that awkward thing where I have to undo my top button on my jeans when I'm too full. <laughs> I also love the color of these, nice and bleach blue, good for summer. Um, and then I've just popped on my favourite heels at the moment, these are from Love Raid, just some simple black mules. 
again really comfy and easy to wear they've just got a really small like kitten heel um so they're easy to just slip on i think the weather is starting to brighten up this week and um for the next few days so i wouldn't probably take a jacket with me just jeans and a t-shirt i think that's all you need i then also have my clutch bag here this is from seen on her it's just a plain ruche clutch doesn't look great at the moment because there's nothing in it but once it's filled out it sits so nicely under the crook of your arm just sort of all molds together um, really nicely. I also have some different hoop earrings in. Um, these are from Ana Luisa, just something a little bit more dressy. Um, I've actually changed my earrings up quite a lot this week, so um, there'll be a few more than usual in the description box for you to check out. But yeah, this is my, um, what I would be wearing if I was attending Super Saturday outfit. But if you guys are going out, I hope you all have a great time. Hey everyone, happy Super Saturday. Um, it's quite early in the morning, I am just popping out to the shops. So I've got a jumper and jeans on because it's still a little bit chilly. Let me turn the brightness up. Oh, wow, it did it on its own. Um, so I have just got on my night cap as you can see um, I haven't done my hair today so that is hiding some hair that needs a little bit of a wash um, I then have on this white sweatshirt from Pretty Little Thing haul coming soon um, I filmed that yesterday so keep an eye out for that so the cap by the way sorry I got from ASOS um, the jumper I'm wearing in a size medium and it fits lovely I've kind of tucked it in at the front um, but it's really nice and oversized and comfy. My chain is from ASOS. I think it's men's, but it's just a really nice, simple gold chain. I then have on my mum jeans. These are ones I had on earlier in the week. And I've sort of like rekindled my love for them. They're a really nice dark wash and really comfy. So I have chucked them on again today. And then I have my Boohoo black sandals on. Um, I kind of want to update these. I feel like they're nice, but... They're maybe a bit too like chunky and platformed for me. I kind of want to get some that are a bit more similar to the um, Chanel ones. So maybe I'll be on the hunt for some of them soon because um, I'm wearing these Boohoo ones a lot. So maybe I need to invest in uh, a slightly more expensive pair. But this is my very casual Super Saturday outfit. Um, and I will catch you tomorrow for the last outfit of the week. It's Sunday, we made it to the end of the week. Um, I have dressed completely wrong for the weather today. I've totally misjudged it. I thought it was gonna be quite warm and sunny. It's not, so I'm actually gonna change into some joggers after um, I filmed this, but I just wanted to show you my new shorts. Um, whilst I've got them on, um, I need to steam them and I need to steam this top as well. So just ignore the creases, but um, I have on these new like running shorts from Topshop. They're this really nice grey elasticated waist with a drawstring and then they have the little scoop at the sides and um, they fit really nicely. I'm actually wearing these in a size 12 which is not my normal size. I would normally go for probably a size 8 in something like this but I didn't want them to fit tight around my bum and I didn't want them to fit tight around my thighs so I thought I'm just going to go for a size 12. Um, and I'll be able to like cinch them in at the waist uh, rather than be too big than too small and I'm actually really pleased that I did go for a size 12 um, because they're just so comfy in the bigger size I've got pockets as well this sort of thing is perfect for holiday if you're going away it's so easy to just pair these with like a white bikini top and a white linen shirt or something like that they're good for traveling in as well um, and they're just super comfy they were really affordable as well I think they were like 14 pounds something like that um, and they also come in white but I think the white is sold out and they come in like a light yellow as well if that's your thing if you're worried about sizing then you can definitely size up and get away with it and I've just got them on with this mango um, muscle t-shirt that I've had for a little while I'm a bit disappointed that these aren't the same grey but what can you do it's one of my favorite t-shirts just so easy to wear with literally anything and everything and then of course I have on my boohoo sandals which I've worn so much this week actually um, and they're just really comfy easy to wear and I also have my little new sac du jour which I don't know if I've even shown in a vlog or anything yet but um, yeah I'm just gonna pop out but I'm gonna change into joggers before I do so but I just wanted to show you these shorts so this is the last outfit of the week as it's Sunday um, I really hope you guys enjoyed this one as we are coming towards the end of lockdown here in the UK things are starting to 
open up and we can actually wear our clothes out. So I'm going to be giving you a lot more inspiration for um, being out and about and being in restaurants and shops and all that sort of stuff rather than just lounging around at home. So that's something to look forward to. If you did enjoy this video, uh, please give it a like. Let me know your favourite outfit in the comments below and I will see you soon with another video.